everyone, it is me, your friend, Sir Tooney Van Dukes, and this is day two of International Clown Week. Yes, and we are doing a public service announcement today. We are telling everyone to get out there and exercise. So one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four. Yes, we exercise. And that way we won't have any more Clown Week. We'll have Clown Strong. Yes, we'll have Clown Strong. So that is the message for today. Get out there and exercise. Yep, I did my exercise today. I went boating in my kayak. Yep, paddled across the Potomac up and down for miles and miles and miles and miles. Yes, I got in my exercise today and I hope you too are getting in some exercise each and every day. Yes, get out there and play. Go ride your bike. See if your parents will come with you. Maybe they will um, ride their bike as well or they'll jog right alongside as you ride your bike. Yeah, maybe you could go skateboarding or on your scooter. But it's important to get out of the house and do some exercise. So that is the theme for today on day two of International Clown Week. So we have jokes to share about exercise and um, the gym and other such topics related to that. And we are going to try, while we're telling the jokes, to create a balloon as handsome as me. Yes, I know it is difficult to think of a balloon being as good looking as me, but that is what we are going to try. So let me grab a few balloons. Um, eeny, moany, miny, me. We'll pick one of those. We'll go for some of these. Yeah, don't know what other colors we'll use. We'll grab another one of those. And, um, why not another one of these, just in case we need them. Oh, and then we'll grab our handy-dandy balloon pump. Yep, so we got some jokes about exercise and fitness and, um, losing weight and, um, running and different topics like that. And while we're doing the jokes, we're going to see if I can create a balloon of me. Hmm. Won't that be fun? So let's get started with the first balloon and the first joke. Why did the balloon, you know, a balloon just like this, real skinny, um, yeah, why did it go to the gym? Yeah, why did a balloon like this go to the gym? It was so skinny. It's not like it needs to lose weight. No, it went to the gym because it wanted to get into shape. Yes, it needed help finding a shape. So it wasn't just this long, skinny balloon, but it was something cool and unusual. Yep. Yeah, this is a better shape for a balloon than that straight thing. So why did the shellfish go to the gym? We'll just put this aside for a minute and grab the next balloon. Yeah, why did the shellfish go to the gym? Well, it was hoping it would get some stronger muscles. Yes, the shellfish wanted some stronger muscles. And I guess you can get muscles stronger at the gym. What kind of exercise do lazy people do? And I hope you aren't one of those lazy people. No, you and your family need to get out and do some exercise. Don't be a lazy person. And definitely don't do any diddly squats. Yes, don't do any diddly squats. They don't help you get into shape. They aren't proper exercise. Oh, this is looking great already. I can see myself in it. 
what kind of music group only makes songs for exercising? Yes, which group makes songs just for you when you're at the gym and doing your exercises? Well, that would be the Sweat Band. Yes, the Sweat Band only does things for you when you do exercises. So yeah, so here we go. Half a body will um, add a little bit more to make it look fancy. And we'll keep going with our jokes. We're not done. So why couldn't the pig, you know, the oink oink, do any exercise? Yeah, the pig said he, he, he couldn't do any exercises. He was hurting. It seemed he had pulled one of his hamstrings. <laughs> yes. I don't know if the pig was telling the truth or not, but he said he pulled a hamstring. Mm. We'll see about that. What is a washing machine's favorite exercise? Yes, the washing machine needs to do exercise too so it can stay in shape and get all your clothes nice and clean. So what is the washing machine's favorite exercise? Well, I hear the washing machine really likes the spin cycle. Yes, the spinning classes um, on those exercise bikes are great for a washing machine to get into shape. So what prize do people get for losing weight? Yes, if you lose a lot of weight, what prize will you get? Well, if you're lucky enough, you'll get the No Belly Prize. Yes, the No Belly Prize. Because no one wants a big belly. They want to be fit. So yes, the No Belly Prize is good for someone who loses their belly. So here we are. We got um, most of the body done. We got some arms. Some legs. He just needs a head so we can be twins. Why do people gain weight around the holidays? Yes, it's very unfortunate. People gain a lot of weight around the holidays. Well, that is because it is so hard to stop eating cold turkey. Yes, if there wasn't so much cold turkey available at the holidays, maybe people could lose weight, but there's just too much cold turkey and people enjoy eating all those leftover dishes. So yeah, that's why you gain weight at the holidays, so it's important to lose it now while it's not a holiday. What kind of running means walking. Yes, what kind of running really means walking. And, um, yeah, you don't really want to be walking when you're doing this type of running. Well, that would be running out of gas. Yes, running out of gas means walking to the nearest gas station, the payphone, or whatever, so that you can, um, call someone for help, so that you can continue your drive home or wherever you're going. What? You don't know what a payphone is? Oh my gosh. Back in the day, payphones were it. We didn't have our cell phones. We had to use payphones if we got stuck somewhere. Yes. And we had to put money in the payphone. It was crazy. Why should you take up marathon training? Yes, you should be training for the marathon. It will help you in the long run. Yes, it's good for you in the long run if you train for the marathon. getting this head nice and straight. 
ready. He had a nose to it. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Nobody knows. Oh, that's a song. I'm just singing. Oh, I'm supposed to be telling jokes, aren't I? Why don't people need to exercise when they get sick? Yeah, if you get sick, you don't need to exercise because your nose will do the running for you. Yes, your nose will be running when you're sick and you don't need to do any more exercise. Your nose will do it all for you. Yep, gave him a big red nose. Let's um, give him a hat like mine so he can be cool in the shade. Why are none of the gyms um, haunted? Yes, there are no haunted gyms. You could look and none of them have ghosts. None of them are haunted. Well, it seems that all of the ghosts that were there have been exercised. Yes, the ghosts have been exercised and there's none left in the gym. So it's safe for you to go into the gym not worrying about the ghosts. They won't bother you at all. How did the T-Rex feel after his workout session? Yeah, the poor T-Rex. He said after his workout he felt really dino sore. Yeah, you shouldn't work out to the point where you're too dino sore. Just work out enough to get the exercise in. Yep, just giving a hat for my mini me clown. Should have it ready in a moment. Get it sized right for his head. Oops, goes the weasel. Stay on his head right. Now we can attach his head to his body, and we'll draw on his face. Where is my good marker? Oh, there's my good marker. Now we need to find the red marker. We're almost done with this guy. Yeah, you can look at him. 
got his baseball cap on just like me. There you have it. I'll get him out of the sun so you can see him. Yep. There we are. We have my mini me. Now I can scoop forward. Yep. So yeah, it's um that's what we did today. We uh, had jokes about exercise. Um, I told you it's important to get out and do something fun and um, exercising every day. Bring your parents along. Um, you got to see this cool balloon guy get created. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching today's episode. Um, this is Sir Tooney Van Dukes celebrating International Clown Week. Um, we're going to try to do several videos for the next several days to get through the whole week. Something different every day. So, yep, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode today. So, until next time, see you later. Alligator, after a while, crocodile.